doing a special video. We're going shopping for some Christmas outfits. Um, now that we've lost weight, each year we tend to need a smaller size. So we're gonna go in and we're going to Marshall's first and we will try to film in there. If not, we'll show you guys what we get after. Shopping. We got a nice haul. Yeah, we did. Um, we didn't find anything at Marshall's. We went to Winners, the Le Chateau outlet, which took out the men's section, which is sad. Um, that is sad. That's very sad. And we went to Winners, didn't find anything. Le Chateau, nothing. And then we went to Old Navy where we found some stuff. We and ended then, up finding, yeah, the most stuff at Old Navy. And then I found a couple things at the at stitches so we'll show you our outfits and what else we wanted to talk about uh, oh we wanted to talk about at the stores shopping in a new size oh and um, you're gonna see me in Marshall's holding up um, two pairs of pants the big size was a 24 which was what I was when I was almost 300 pounds and the size 8 was the size I was currently wearing today However, I bought my first pair of size 6 jeans today. So, um, I just wanted to show you the huge difference in sizes. I went from a size 24 to a size 8 and now a size 6. They don't fit like perfect, but I'm almost in a size 6. And I'll grab you one of my t-shirts. I think I still have an old t-shirt. It's like a 3X or a 4X, but anyways, I'll show you and I got some new button-up dress shirts and some jeans and stuff So we'll show you guys You really uh, can see the difference when you're in when you're clothes shopping and you've, lo you've lost a, a big amount of weight It really hits you when you when you're in there and you see the actual the physical sizes of the different clothes that you used to wear and you you're in the change room and uh yeah, you you really see it there. It hit it, like you know it because you live with it every day. But it hits you more when you when you go try on clothes. Yeah, and the the other thing that you you had some trouble today because you needed a smaller size in clothes, but when you tried it on, it fit perfect. It showed your muscles how how hard you've worked on your muscles and that you're a lot muscul more muscular now. However. Sometimes after you've lost a huge amount of weight and you have extra skin, um, it gets in the way. It's hard. It's like uh, relearning what size you are. You have to go and try the clothes on. And I, I, w I was a typical guy that before I would just go in and grab, no, I need this size. I just grab it. Now I can't do that because everything fits so differently. And each different store, a large shirt fit me at the first store at Marshall's. And then the second store we went to, none of the larges fit properly. They but, were they were tight in the chest or, or too loose in the shoulders and, and some, yeah, and, and you gotta be wary of like, you don't want, like we have a lot of hanging skin. We both lost, you know, a lot of weight. So we have extra skin and- And sometimes part, it shows like- Sometimes different shirts or pants show the parts that you don't really wanna be showing too much. Yeah, like today I tried on a dress and it fit me really, really nicely, but it showed some of that extra skin that I haven't been able to tone up yet on my arms. So it's it's like it's great because you're fitting in smaller sizes, but at the same time, you still have that reminder of where you used to be, and you just you navigate around it. But sometimes it can be a little bit frustrating because. You know, Kyle found a shirt and I found a dress, then they both fit really great. However, some of our extra skin decided to make an appearance and we didn't buy those items because we didn't feel 100% comfortable. Yeah. Um, the other thing is, 
I knew my size 8 pants, I just bought them a couple of months ago, but I, could, I can feel them getting really loose um, in the legs and in the butt area. And so I knew that I could probably try on a size 6. However, when you're used to always trying clothes on when you're bigger, and you go to try them on, you expect them not to fit. You expect if you go down a size, or even at the size you are, you expect to pull them on and barely be able to get them over your calves. And when I put, when I took the size six off the shelf, I thought, no way. I know my eights are loose, but there's no way. I was doing the same thing. Like I was always in double, triple, quadruple XL. So to go in the store and grab a large, I took the shirt in knowing like, okay, it looks about like it would fit, but you, in the back of your head, you're still thinking like, there's no way it's going to be tight. It's going to be uncomfortable. And well, and even I had to tell you the other day, like your pants are falling off of you. You need a better, bigger size or a yeah. smaller size. And you would just come to me and said, Oh, I think my jeans are okay. And then I said, well, they look, it looks like you're swimming in them. Yeah. But it's it's hard to accept it when you're so used to being bigger all the time. Yeah. So, yeah, I was so uncomfortable bringing the size sixes into the dressing room. And I was shocked when they went over my calves. But at the same time, it does feel really good to be in a smaller size it, clothes. It does. Like, I, I haven't been a size six. The only time that I was a size six, ladies, I was 11 years old. So, now here I am, 32 and I fit into a lady size six, which is crazy. So yeah, we'll uh, do kind of a bit of a new clothes holiday fashion show for you guys. And uh, yeah, I guess we can end the video. Yeah, that's pretty much it. And um, the clothes that we bought, it, there we made a pact sort of to go out of our comfort level because also when you lose weight, weight when you're overweight, you tend to go for clothes that will hide who you are and will hide your size. Like I um, only wore black t-shirts for like years and years and I years. only wore big, black big, as well. baggy black t-shirts. I only wore black. I wore everything big. Everything covered up. Even when I started losing weight, I didn't want to wear tight, tighter clothes, fitting clothes. So today they're, they're completely out of our comfort zone, even down to the boots that I bought. Everything that I bought, I, I'm normally not comfortable wearing. But we challenged each other to challenge ourselves to find things that we normally wouldn't wear because our bodies are changing and we should be showing them off because we work so hard for them. So um, we will go and change and show you guys our new outfits. We hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and we will see you next time. See you guys. Bye guys.